Uh, so today I'm going to be sharing another recipe uh, with you and it's called Caramel Oatmeal Chewies. Oh my goodness. Uh, now I did get this recipe from my mom. Now uh, this recipe has been around quite a while. It's starting to turn kind of brown and getting kind of um, faded uh, where it has been folded. Uh, but it is an awesome recipe so I thought that I would share this with you. I also have one uh, from my grandmother. I'm not going to do that one today but I had to show you this recipe because this has been around for many, many years. And uh, she gave it to me a long, long time ago, uh, but it is starting to fade and uh, get torn and everything. So this is another awesome recipe that I'm going to be sharing with you uh, soon. But anyway, today, caramel oatmeal chewies, uh, absolutely fabulous. You're just going to love them. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and get started on our caramel oatmeal chewies. Uh, you're going to need a stand mixer or a hand mixer, whichever you have. Uh, now to our uh, bowl, we're going to add one and three-fourths cups of oats, one and one-half cups of flour, that's all-purpose flour, three-fourths cups of packed brown sugar, one half teaspoon of a baking soda and one four teaspoon of salt. Also three fourths cups of butter which is one and a half stick. And we're just gonna get this all uh, mixed up together so it's nice and smooth. Okay, now this is kind of like your uh, base to these uh, chewies, uh, and so it is going to be crumbly, but that's what you want. So don't panic when it's crumbly. <laughs> okay. So now I'm just going to dip out one cup of this because we are going to reserve this cup um, for the top part of our bars when it's all done. So I'm just gonna take out a cup, set it over there for later. Uh, now you need a nine by 13 uh, baking dish that has been lightly sprayed. And you're gonna go ahead and just add um, your mixture here into the bowl, into the pan. And we're just going to pat it down in there really good. And um, you're going to need to have your oven set on 350 degrees because you're going to bake this, oh, I don't know, 10, 12 minutes. And that will be your first layer of these chewies. Absolutely, oh, so yummy. Okay, so into, these, into the oven, these go for 10 to 12 minutes. Okay, y'all, so uh, the base to my chewies is all out of the oven now. And look, Brooklyn. I'm using your pot holders. They work fabulous. Thank you so much. Uh, so to this, we're going to go ahead and add um, one cup of uh, chocolate chips. Oh my, my, my. <laughs> Yumminess is what I'm talking about. Now mine are Hershey's chocolate chips, but you can use any uh, brand that you like. So you just need a cup of those and also a cup of chopped nuts. Now I am using, you know it, pecans, uh, but you can use walnuts, you can use peanuts, or you don't have to add the nuts if you cannot eat them. Um, that is um, you know, entirely your choice there on the nuts, but we like pecans, so that's what I use. Okay, now set that aside for just a moment. Um, now we're going to take one cup of caramel sauce, you know, the kind of sauce that you put on uh, your ice cream. I'm just going to add it to this bowl here. Oh, yummy, yummy. And to that we are going to um, add a fourth a cup of flour. And I'm just going to mix that up together. And this is going to be drizzled on the top of, of this. Oh my goodness. Pure yumming is that. You just want it mixed up. It's just going to thicken it up just a little bit for you. 
yummy, yummy, yummy. Okay. Set that aside. Bring my chewies back over here. We're just going to add this right on top. Now you don't uh, have to get it right on the sides because it will spread out a little bit. I kind of keep mine a little bit away from the side there. But if you get some over there, don't worry. Don't panic. It's okay. Okay. Yum! This is smelling fabulous. Okay. Now we are ready to go ahead and put on uh, the reserve mixes on the bottom. Now we're ready to go ahead and sprinkle this on top here. Kind of packed it down in there. Oh my goodness. Now this is going to go back into the oven. Uh, 350 degrees still. Uh, 18 to 22 minutes. Uh, we just want it all nice and melted and ooey and gooey and just pure yummy. Okay, so into the oven this goes, 18 to 22 minutes. Okay, y'all, so the caramel oatmeal chewies are all done. It's making my house smell oh so yummy. Uh, but all the caramely goodness in these, oh my goodness, y'all are going to love them. Uh, but anyway, y'all, I appreciate y'all watching. I'll see you again next time. Bye now.